Okay, that's gonna be with my manager face. Put the extra weight on. Hopefully not too much weight. Let's have a look at how I'm doing in the last, say, five games. It's been four wins and one draw. And that was against AS Monaco. There's been a 4 0 against Man United. And now we're up against Ludo Goritz in the Champions League. So I can do a full rotation for that game. If I lost that, I wouldn't matter that much after being Barcelona. I don't know if you're allowed to do that in the real thing. It's going to do a full rotation. Let's continue. And I haven't done welcome to the Spurs season 17, 18, part 6, is it? Part 6, I think. This is. And, um, yeah, we're, if you have a look at the, the table, we're only one point behind the leader in the first season. And must be all the tactic, really, and what I've done with the tactic, because I haven't really changed any players. I've had the first window of transfers, like, off, kind of. Like, in the menu, before you, like, start the game, you can select that. Okay, I'm just going to continue then. Uh, now, to go to the competitions. I'm look, look, we're only one point, I'm in fourth, but I'm only one point behind the leaders. I've come up from ninth, but basically, so that's seven points behind now. I'm only one point behind. And I, I was ninth, but I was only three points behind the second place. So I would have been like fifth or sixth if I had to kept being how I'm being, but I'm being better than that now. This is amazing, Football Manager 18. Okay, little credits. It's been an easy win for me, I think. And let's do a full rotation. I'll get ready for it here. Pick rotated squad, full rotation. Okay, so that's what I want. And just to organize the bench. So that's what I want like that. to the next game. Um, G'day Insidium and Snorlax. Um, yeah, I'm on a laptop. Um, yeah, sorry the resolution is not that good, but I need to have that because I've got less um, um, better internet because I'm in the country.
Yeah, so if you can't see quite well, I'm going to do the commentary for the match and try and do that. Yeah, it is kind of on a laptop anyway, but said, um, yeah, I've got less resolution doing it through the, the OBS. I haven't got like a proper, like, um, a commercial kind of Twitch application kind of. I'm just doing it through OBS, so eventually I'll have to get that. Yeah, I've got about 400 bit upgrade or something like that. Like it's fine to watch someone else's Twitch with the internet, but to, to do the upload like for Twitch is not very good. So I'm trying to do lots of rotations with this high injury risk for most of my players. And I lost um, Elder World um, and it wasn't very good. And um, I tried to rotate it more how I wanted to after that. I had a look at training. I didn't really want to change that because I couldn't change it into groups. I just want to change into groups, have less training for them. But I can't really do that, I don't think. So I just did more rotation through the squad. So I got Harry Kane on a 205k per week contract and basically I've done most of my transfer fees to the wage budget. And I'll just go to my tactic. Okay, so you've got like excellent upload features. Maybe you got the MBN. I need to really get the MBN. And like Nick still can get it at the moment, but I've got to still wait for it. Me, I'm like, I don't know, understand how Nick still can get it, and I can't. Um, yeah, sorry about that. That's just my um, footy, like AFL, like Australian rules footy kind of um, toy were. And talks to me. Okay, I'll have to try and continue on here. Okay, so this is basically a tactic. On inside forward, they're both on left to right wing. Got false nine for a striker, two central midfielders that are attacking, a half back for defence, so he will help with the defenders. Initially I had three in defence, three central de defenders, and then I went for a half-back, so I can actually use defensive midfielders. And there's two complete wing-backs, both sides, and they're linking up with the inside forwards. And it's just control mentality and fluid team shape. And plus I got set pieces, kind of, that I've done specially. Kind of, I'll give you a quick look at that. So that's defensively, and this is attacking. So I've got the striker attacking from deep, got the two central defenders on each post, attacking near post and far post, and got the winger, left winger, challenging the keeper, and got the left um, midfield centre lurking outside the area. And that goes the same for the other other corner. And just for throw-ins, I've got the right winger and striker um, to come short for the ball. 
and like on the left, if it's a left throw in, then I'd have the um, left winger. I've got the one of the midfield centers to look out the, in the area, and I've got the attacking midfielder left to go to the near post, and then midfield the center forward and defender left forward. So that tricks them having the defender left go forward, and when it's from the left side, I have the defender right go forward. And just one other thing from the free kicks, there's more like direct, indirect, and indirect ones as well, but I just do the same thing. And that's like defense, but in attack, I've got them all forward and just the midfield, center left, defensive midfielder, and the two full backs or wing backs to stay back if needed. So I could have like theoretically everyone forward on a free kick. And does be exciting sometimes in the counter attacks on that. So I have a look what you're saying now. I've just tried to have a talk then, so I have to have a look what you're saying after that. Okay, so that's your last your last place to maybe get the ambience. So that's a bit bad. Okay, can't request transfer, denies, get, get back with the under 12s, okay. So it's okay. So uh, it's been like, um, who was it? Uh, ben Davies to have a request for transfer because he's playing so well. And I've tried to just pay more money at the moment and see if that works. I might lose some players in the next transfer window. Or have big fights with the players. So he, this is a new thing here, the pre-match tactical briefing. So I just hand it over to the system manager. A lot of things I hand over to the system manager to just try and get it kind of like I don't stuff up too much. Okay. Winks gets rewarded for fine forms. I've got him on a better contract. I really like having Harry Winks. He's a very good utility player, or not utility player, but said like rotation player is what I mean. Can play on the wing though, maybe. I'll just have a look. Well, you can't really, supposedly, but they kind of do a mine. And it's like the team, I've got like a under-21 there in Edwards, playing in the Europa, well, it's not Europa League, in the Champions League. Used to Spurs being in Europa League, I have to get used to them being in the Champions League now. Okay, just to kick off here, I try and have a zoomed in TV camera. Uh, for my um, 3D, so this is just a start. And I'll try and do some commentary as well. Okay, it's a bit defensive sometimes. There's not many shots through the team in the first half, and it becomes more open in the second half. Okay, so it's by with the ball to Walker Peters to Edwards, and what's he going to do? Go back to Wanyama to Walker Peters to Wanyama to Dyer. Goes to Walker Peters, 
now he puts the ball down the wing to Edwards. He'll probably do a cross from here and does on the ground. And Kane goes for a shot and hits the bar. Okay, nothing much happening here. I'll try and get as much um, completed passes in um, in the in my with my tactic, and it's not a good one for that. But if I can do that effectively, I'm going to win. I'm pretty sure to win then. Here's a free hit with Kesaru and goal. What am I supposed to do about that? Just amazing goal. I don't think Loris would have got that. Okay, so one nil down. I'll have, I'll put on the um Champions League um table if I can. So I've got it there. So Wenderson, Sasha, Antonov, Kapanharo, Sasha goes forward, Kapanharo to Chilkov, Chilikov, Antonov through to Kapanharo, it's too good this, and he stopped the Dovorm for a corner now. Kapanharo. To cross it in from the corner, then Billy easily clears it, and then Kane gets the ball and passes to Edwards. He's going with the ball, dribbling, lost it, but it's gone to Dembele, then to Deli Ali, to Walker Peters, going to cross it, and who's there? It's cleared by Ludo Goritz, and Vitongan's got the ball now. To Wanyama. To Vatongan. To Walker Peters. To Edwards. To Davies. Crosses it in. Edwards. Oh, missed it. Got saved by the goalie, I think. Fatu or so then the corner by Ericsson to Dyer no good cleared out for a throw in Okay. So is this your um is this for you playing um Spurs? Or are you playing as Spurs? I thought you were actually playing against Spurs. Snorlax. So as you can see, I'm still kind of first in the group, even losing to Ludigris. Okay, you're a Charles team. Okay, it's half the time. I'll just have a look at the analysis. Um, match stats. Passes completed 216 to 127. So I'm getting dominated in the passes completed. I need to just get, get passing the ball, basically. I might do some subs. Who's not going that well? So, I haven't really got the best subs either. I'm going to move Eric 
to add the defensive risk builder and take off on Yama for Sanchez and start the second half. It's a free kick by Ericsson. Dyer's got it to Sanchez. Goal! Just brought on Sanchez, single the goal. So a draw will be alright. I'm five points still in front of Ace Monaco. So I want to really just get first in the in our group and see what I can do from there. And again, I scored off a free kick, so I don't really think it's a uh, free kick um, cheat. I think it's basically just playing the free kick well. Like before, you kind of get a cheat where your defenders are scoring all the time, and I know that was a defender, but he hit the ball back into to him like Dyer, so it could have been like a striker even. Here's another corner, and it's gone to Dembele, the rebound to Kane. To Edwards and goal, so I'm getting a lot off these free kicks and like the rebounds from him. So Edwards got a goal and he's like an under 21 player, he's got two goals now. Here's a throw-in, I've still got set pieces from the throw-ins. So Walker Peters to Ericsson to Kane to Davies, goal. Another goal to Ben Davies. Three goals now. Kane to Davies, lovely play. I just want to see the who's got the goals, kind of. So Dave Sanchez. Ah, oh, it was okay. So there's been two defenders get a goal. I just want to play out this with just one sub. Yeah. Oh, I can do some subs because I'm ahead by that much. Is Ericsson to Davies on another free kick to Vertonghen to Sanchez. That's taken away by Ludo Gritz. Walker Peters intercepted their through ball. Goes to Davies, goes to Vertonghen, goes to Davies. I think this is playing for the actual final whistle. Davies to Ericsson. Walker Peters goes down the wing to Edwards to Dembele back to Walker Peters and Ericsson's got it but it's all over now and it's 3-1 to Ludo Goretz or to Spurs against Ludo Goretz 
So after half time, we're just to change, bringing Eric Dyer to the defensive midfielder and Sanchez to the defender centre, and coming on for Wanyama. We've played a lot better since then. And got another win in the Champions League. Davies on form is top to score, easy victory. Ali gets reward for fine form. Gerson gets reward for fine form. Press please with a comeback. And post match analysis. So Dai got 7.7. .7. Walker Peters got 7.4. Davies got 8.6. And Kane got 8. Without a goal. Tottenham vs Southampton Sixth game They're in second so I'll play my best team Sang Hu Ming is still on international duty So I get trolled for fine form. Got some scouting players there, so I can have a bit more of a look at them. Just acknowledge them all. So basically, so basically, I want to be like to to try and just show some um, things I look for. So I've got on selection info, but I'll just go to my custom view. And that's not it. I have to redo that. Custom. There we go. So just acceleration, pace, and dribbling. So Muslim Dimbelli is really good at dribbling and good at acceleration and pace as well. This pass is complete per 90, 52.61, an average rating is 7.28. So. He's like my best, like team dynamic or team pr like um, principle kind of player, and then Deli Ali as well. But so it's good how most of the players like, except for where is it? Ryan Loft, I think, actually conform to to or be good at like acceleration, pace, and dribbling. So, so I'd like to keep all of them except um, him.
Yes, yeah, so Snow Knights, you'll have to keep me updated with your game. And how you go in there and will you win the Champions League, I think, with Chelsea. Out of the world for begins rehabilitation phase. So it'd be good to get the actual nearly the best um, defender center in the team back and maybe the most influential one because in real life because it's gone a lot better defense since we got him. And like it might have been good before with Vatongan, but we'll having two like world class defensive centers. That's made like Tottenham very good at defence. I'm like, we really need maybe the best ones. How we kind of defend or used to defend. So somehow Southampton the second, I'm going to put my best team in against them. I've got Hard of it, Huddersfield 12th in, so I'll try and rotate kind of for the Huddersfield game, not the Southampton game. But I actually do do rotation, and I did it against um, Ludo Goretz. So I got excellent form and I got strong form um Southampton. I'm favourite though with the boogies. So I'll just kinda of quick pick the best team I can do. We've got Lamel there somehow. Dembele is good, Dyer, Trippier Sanchez for Tolkien. So that's right that. Um I'll put one Yama there, Warrior there, Edwards there, Harold Winks there, Carl Walker Peter says to come off the let's go to my squad. Carl Walker Peters needs to come off for a striker. Let's have it for the other Laurenti. Let's have it Laurenti. And that should be good enough. Tenny Rose can, can come off uh, one fourth. And we'll go to the game. I can't score. Select. Okay, so I'm trying to implement Eric Lamello in my rotation and see if he's actually playing good enough. I want basically all my players, hopefully, except for the goalkeeper, and you can kind of understand that if he's not having that many much to do, then most of my outfield players get seven or above with this tactic. Okay, you can hear the slides, that's cool. Okay, we're just starting out here. And kicking off, here you go, here's Dyer to Dalielli. To Trippier. He's going to cross it, but it's out for a corner, is it? Yes, it's out for a corner. Here's the corner from Lamella. And just as intercepted by Virgil, Gabby Adini has got it now on the counter attack. Redmond's got it. 
is going out to Tanage. And that's the end of the highlight. Okay, another corner, Lamella crosses in to Vitongan. Oh, nearly a goal. It's a good off to a good start, I suppose. I had five shots to none. Just like another highlight, hopefully, or click out chance. So basically, I'll be 34 if I win, and Southampton will only be 32. I still need to somehow win, though. It's not looking like that at the moment. Okay, we're going to go into half time, maybe nil more. And look, Fraser Forster's got 7.2. Here's Ericsson for the corner to Sanchez to Kane. Goal, there we go. Got a goal just before half time. I think really my set pieces are so um, special, and it's not really a, a set piece cheat. As you can see, Sanchez just puts it down the cane. They should be marking cane. And I have just got him to to kind of be more intelligent how he how he actually does the corner. When it was corner chase before, it'd be like a defender center or whoever was attacking the near post or far post would, would score a lot. And that's not the case here, they're actually heading it to someone else. Okay, it's half time. Just wanted to check the completed passes. And match stats. Compl passes complete 232 to 205, so I'm winning that. But it's just kind of by a bit, so, but if I win it by a bit, we'll get close enough on completed passes, then I'll probably win the game, I think. Here we go, kicking off the second half. Okay, that must be West Sydney Warriors, I think, or something like that. I'm trying to, I'm trying to, oh, wander, Wanderer, sorry. So it works in FM 18 as well, as in real life. You go, I had another corner then or something. Oh no, it was like um, Southampton. Okay, Ward Prowse with the cross. And it's out to Tadish. And he's calling fresh shot, but Loris has saved. Saved it, so we're only got a 1 0 lead.
Okay, he's sent back and gets 6 to 10 goals a year. That's probably better than some um, midfielders in some teams in the Premier League. And he's sent back still out. So here's Ericsson. To Dembele, to Kane. To Deli Ali. To Davies, to Ericsson then. It's a nice play of the ball here to, to Davies, to Dyer, to Dembele. Slowly making their way up the pitch. Then to Kane. See what he can do. And a goal. And that's like like just how Kane's so special to get the shots from outside the box so easily. Wonderful goal by him. So that's like my weakness like for the team, like getting goals from all long shots. So that's another one. So, so And that will hopefully win me this game. And I'm up into second and only one point behind. War Prowse is going to gonna do the free kick. And it goes back to him now from Cedric. And then Redmond... Is looking for a way through and gets tackled by Trippier. Virgil is trying to pass around. May is passing around. Cedric's got the ball. Tadic has got the ball now. He's looking to do something with it. And he runs a bit. And then Ward Prowse has got the ball. Redmond's got the ball now. Coming in to have a shot. And just misses. Okay, some time about the eighth minute. Okay, so Aurea can come on for Trippier. Harry Winks on for Dembele. And one fourth on for for Saint or for the Tongan. And that should do. Okay, foul on Dembele. And he's got his second yellow card. Whoever it was. Uh, Tadich, I think. Okay, got a free kick here. Sanchez to Winks. The cane has intercepted or tackled by someone by someone from Southampton. Now Redmond's got it. Bertrand's got it. Passes back to Redmond. Hogeberg's got it to Long. It's gonna have a shot and it gets a goal. It's two one now. It's gonna be exciting in the final minutes now. Okay. So it's 88th minute, 89th, 90th minute, 5 extra minutes, 91st, 92nd, 93rd, 94th. This is their final go to get a goal. Ward Prowse gets the throw in and kicks the ball out. And I think this will be it. That's another Spurs victory. Not actually thrashing them, but getting the three points. Yes, yeah, so that was good. I seen a half time the completed passes were fairly similar. So that was good. Two goals to Harry Kane. So that's very good too. And I did actually cope without Harry Kane when he was injured. Somehow I went worse, but I've been able to cope somehow.
Okay, so Tottenham defeat Tim in Southampton. And Kane shines that Tottenham win. So prayers. Harry Kane. So maybe I should do more of that. Like when they say they've had a good game to praise them. I said I haven't been doing that as much. And it's just abysmal. My um, team harmony or whatever it is. I'll have a look at it, the dynamics. Managerial support is. My match cohesion is good. Dressing room atmosphere is average. It's getting better now with five wins in a row. And... And my managerial support is un unhappy. Or abysmal, sorry. And... Hugo Loris is unhappy, so I'll never talk to him. Kieran Tripp is playing, and Ben Davis asking to leave. I'm trying to secure him here still. So let's have a talk to Hugo Loris. It's becoming clear that Ben Davies' issues are heavily affecting the atmosphere. It's, thanks. I'm extremely grateful for your input and I'll do my best to resolve the matters. So to talk to Ben Davies in direction, I can't really talk to him. Here we go. I'll try and talk to him next time. Chris Huddersfield then. I really need to win, but I want to rotate players. And try and make it way that I not get an injury, another injury to Hurricane or something like that. Okay, so I'm in third now on goal difference. Hang on, United Seek Davies still. Lose Ben Davies. Have to look for his replacement. I'll look for a left back. Let's go now. Pre-match analysis. My squad, my Davies, Christian. So it might be the worst thing to lose Ben Davies, but then he's playing that well that um, I don't really want to lose him. So 
So delay only rolls him to AP. Don't want to do that. Just want to leave how it is. I'll match this. Lamella. Under 23 squad until match hit. And Sanchai Oreo. Under 23 squad until match hit. Continue. Continue. Earth versus Southampton. Bradford City versus Bury. Southampton won 5 2 against Bournemouth to go second. They've got an extra game they play though. Elder World signs new Tottenham deals, so that's very good. 185k per week. So Tottenham is against Huddersfield now, and in fourth, and Sissoko resumes full training, so that will be good. And then go back to my squad then. Here's Sissoko, and... Just want to leave him out of oh, for Marcus Edwards, I can do. So I'm going to put Marcus Edwards out. Here we go, we're very heavily favoured. I just want to go to my squad and do slight rotation. Simple to do that, and speak to rotate and so I was slight rotation. And then do the subs. So Colin, Arthur, Peters there. I want, I want, where is he? Find Floyd there. There's uh, Michael Miller there. And Wanyama there. Yep, so I've got my setup there. I've got Ben Davis and Trippier playing. So that should be good. Another victory. Yes, yeah, so we're playing similar formations, just not the actual instructions maybe in how our style of play. 
Ben Davis very poor, so that's not the best thing, but I'll just keep on playing him. And see if he gets man in the match. And his morale will get better. Here we go, got Davies here, see what he does. There's some well then to the Tongan, but this is just a start kinda. It should kinda go to the next highlight too. I'm calling the goal of in thirty three seconds. That must be my um quickest goal ever in a match. And I have done it with the FM eighteen. So here we go, Ericsson goes forward to Kane who brings it forward as well. Goes through a few a few passes of through ball to Ericsson who finishes quite easily for one nil. One shot, one on target, one goal in 30 seconds. Amazing. It does happen in the Premier League, but not as much now, I don't think. And I'm first, looking first on the on the active league table. So Deli Ali goes through a shot and misses. So man, who he is in provisional first place at the moment. Here's Eric's with a set piece. Eric's with a set piece shot, and just missed. Okay, Billing does a long throw in. The Tongan heads the ball out. Kane gets it. Here comes the counter attack off the throw in. Uh, except Low um, tackles Kane and dispossesses him. To Ince, to Moy, to Ronnie Lopez, to De Potre. And it's gone over. Okay, Mossy with a goal kick to Schindler, to Zenka, to gets intercepted by Sanchez. Then Valley goes forward now, gives it to Ericsson, and it's been tackled. Nearly a penalty, but it was well tackled, and they got the ball now to Lopez, to Moy, to Lopez. Dembele tackles him and dispossesses him and gives the ball to Ericsson. Ericsson gives to Deli Ali, brings the ball forward to Sasaku and gives the cross to Kane and he has an easy finish kind of there and misses. I said I don't want to really complain about that because he's got that many goals anyway this season and he's the top goal scorer so let's not worry about him missing one. That's probably his easiest chance, really, that's all. Here's Ericsson. With a free kick to Dembele. Goes across, and there's a goal, an easy goal to Ben Davies. Assist by Christian Ericsson. 2-0 to Spurs. And it's too good. I'll try and look at this as good as I can from the cross. And um, the goalie just missed the interception, I think. Uh, 
Okay, it's half time. I was doing analysis on the completed passes. See if it's been like I want. 194 to 186, so I'm not dominating that. But I said, um, if I can keep it even, then I'll probably win the match. Here we go, Kane kicks it off to start the second half. Let's see if I can win 4 0, like in the real thing. Okay, a throw in. I've got a set play from the throw ins to Sasaku, but missed it. Missed it up and it's been kicked down the wing, but Sanchez collects it to Vatongan. Here comes the rebound from the throw in to Ericsson. Probably going for a cross and does, and to Kane and then a goal. Fancy that, Harry Kane getting the goal. Still top scorer, I think. And just finished it so easily, I think. I'm just trying to watch him. Yeah, he's just got a forward run, just not marked by the defenders because he's outsmarted than being the false nine, I think. And it's just like an easy goal. A lovely Tottenham or Spurs move. Here you go, the Moyes got a free kick and misses. Okay, what have we got happening here? Injury to Dembele, so that's not exactly what I wanted. The spring on Winks for him. And it's about time to do the subs. So, I'll spring on Lorente for Kane. And Lamella hasn't played that much, so I'll bring on his first Asaku. So three nil we're gonna do in the real in the real thing we got one four nil. Here's Zenka or oh, stop oh, stop play that's a goal. Well the Matthews Jorgensen Jorgensen. So three one to Spurs and I got a very good stop by Loris and tried to stop by whoever was on the left post. Or far post, and I just got a goal, unfortunately. I said it's 3 1, so it doesn't matter. I just want to check out my defense because that's very important in Football Manager. And I just want to see if I've got it like the actual Spurs in real life kind of defense. Here we go, so that's full time. Another win to Spurs. 
and I had 15 shots to 8, so still was pretty good. Basically, we double our click hard chances and shots with with enough possession and completed passes, and then we win like two one or one nil or whatever nearly every game. Wilson to belly injured out for four to six weeks, so that's. I just want to send those specialists. Class Eric's on the phone. Let's have some praise for Ericsson. West Ham won 3 0 over Everton. Brighton beat Chelsea. Burnley beat Arsenal. And Swansea beat Leicester. So there was a few upsets. And we'll see how the competition is now. I'm still only one point behind, but two points in front of third and fourth. And on goal difference, I'm eight behind, but I'm not worried about that at the moment. I want to have a look at the actual for and against, if I can. Just look here for that. Here we go, for and against, so four. So we're the fifth best offensive team, and against, we're actually worse defensively. One, two, three, four, five, six, so six, six best defensively, but it's only just. And like it's even some of the fifth best kind of, kind of defensively. So it's fifth best attack and fifth best defensively, and and we've won five in a row. Two one to Boom against Boom with four nil somehow against Man United. Two nil against Stoke. Two one against Southampton and three one against Huddersfield. So out of the last five games, I mean three goals. And two, four, six, ten, thirteen, thirteen goals in five games. And and only that much against. So this is turning out to be like a very special season, and it's the first season. So next up's Liverpool. So this will be a test to see what I can do. So let's continue. They're in seventh. Post match analysis, Huddersfield. Christian Eriksson was key player. Kane got eight, Eriksson got nine. And all the all the defence and goalkeeper and defend, all the defensive players were all seven or above. You'll have to tell me how you'll go on Snorlax, if you want to. Alright, Lorente resumes full training. Pretty much the last of Liverpool. Seemed to go down the right corner and possess it there. He plays Alex Oxlade Chamberlain. It's not so hard. Yeah, so basically, I don't need to really get new players, I just need to keep the actual players I've got somehow. 
without them going to like ruin the trees or whatever. And then the thing is to replace them with suitable replacements. So here we go. Fernando Lorente is not much fit. This is Sasaku as well. And one fourth. Yeah, so I had a bad entry to Musa Dembele, which is very kind of crucial to me with Dembele because he is my best kind of team dynamic or team principal kind of player. Eric Lamel is injured now. He's just gone and come back to me. So I'll leave it to the physio. Carl Walker Peters is the physio. I had a chat with Paul Gazaniga earlier today and the player wants to discuss his lack of first team football. Discuss this issue with Gazaniga. Shouldn't be like this, I shouldn't understand the really reserves and stuff. And I've got Vorm on it. Okay, so I'm going to line for him. Well, ball for loans. Offensive clubs for loans. Let's see that at the moment. Got the form anyway. Okay, so still not wearing shots. There's a problem, so I don't know why Harry Kane's shot was a long long range shot. It must be like from way out. So I've done that now. Something lose came in. Eric Lamella. No offers for Gazaniga. So let's try and just get him to go there. This club's interesting one. Cardiff. It's Cardiff interested. So. Cardiff. Let's just try and get him to 
Don't do that. Goodness, yes, Carl. More for Peters. It's alright. Fernando Lorente is alright. And Toby at all the world is becoming better to actually play. So it's Tottenham versus Liverpool. I'm 2 lost 25 for this. Racer forms excellent. League position is second. Can we do it? Also, Dembele needs to go out. This is against Liverpool, so I want to have my best team in. Let's bring Harry Winks in. And who can I have here? I'll just have Marcus Edwards, I think. I've sunk him in back. So I can have him on him. And I said the Mel is injured. So that can be Marcus Edwards. Let's go to my squad if you like that. You can. So Ben Davis, Kieran Trippier, Eric Dyer, I got them. I want to swap early in. Some humans on the international. So I'm bringing. Case yesterday. And Carl Walker Peters. Can go off the search area. Yep, so I picked my subs now. Let's go into this and try and win. Okay, so the kickoff. Big match against um, Liverpool. So Liverpool start out. It's raining in the game. Okay, so Robertson um, throws into there. Roberto Firmino is coming forward to Chamberlain. Save by Loris, nice save. Loris does a goal kick. Goes forward towards Harry Kane, gets it. This was S by Gomez. Back to the keeper. The Tonga gets it to Coutinho. Roberto, Roberto Firmino is coming forward and it's safe for Loris. It goes behind for a corner. So here we go. Robertson crosses in. It's gone across, crossed in by Lovren. Kicked way away by the Tottenham defence. Here you go, a uh, uh, throw in to Trippier. Sasaku's so got it. Kane's got it. D Davis got it. Winks. Oh, nearly a goal to Winks. Great save by Liverpool keeper. Robertson with a corner. What's going on here? Coutinho got it and went straight to Loris. So.
his injury to Davies, so Aurea can come on. It's the only goal. Just missed that. I was checking the chat. It's a goal to Deli Ali. Let's have a look at the replay. Dyer has it. Goes to Aurea. Let's just come on to Ericsson. Passes to Kane. Puts it through for Deli Ali. Goal. Great play by Spurs. Pain scores again. Nearly the same sort of goal, but oh, Sissoko got it somehow. And they got saved by the goalie. Here's a corner to Ericsson. Takes the corner, Sanchez goes up for the ball. It gets rebounded out of the penalty box. Kane gets it, Winks gets it. Dali Ali has it, then gets dispossessed. Okay, another throw in Trippier to Dyer to Trippier to Kane crosses it and there's who is it? An own goal to Client. Ericsson was on the far post. The client got an own goal somehow. Trying to stop Ericsson from getting it. That's two now. Spurs are top of the league again. That's half time. So let's have a quick look at the analysis for completed passes. 162 to Liverpool, 202 to Spurs. So no wonder we're winning. Being that good at the moment. Let's start the second half. Okay, Klein's got the throw in to Ings. Back to Klein. Henderson to Lalana. There's a goal. Nice head down by Henderson, and Lalana's finished like so easily. So that's 2 1 now. Trying to think what what um subs I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do late subs this game. The Tongan has it. Goes to Trippier. 
guys, who wants to suck you? It's in Tally Alley. It's a Trippier. Try to hang on to the ball and place it forward. It goes to Gomez, he intercepts. It goes to Ings, goes to Mane. Continue. Ings has got it. Try and have a shot. And it's saved by Loris. Out for a corner. Continue crosses it in from the corner to Lovren and it gets cleared by Spurs. Out for a throw in. Robertson throws in to Coutinho, to Lallana, to Chamberlain, to Mane, to Ings, and that's an easy goal to all now. What is going on? To, to go down two, two goals when I'm too nil in front. Come on, Spurs. So we see this. I just want to bring forth on or something. At the moment, I just try for it. Uh, so, let's bring on the fourth. For, for Sanchez. See if that shows things up better. Here we go, Winks. It's been tackled by Ronaldo, Lalana, to Lovren, to Ronaldo, to Coutinho, to Henderson, to Ronaldo, to Ings, to Mane, gonna cross it, and Lalana, no, Coutinho, oh dear, I am going to have a Tongan. Isn't yeah, I think it's no goal to you for Tonga. So man, he just has gone across the line and missed that hitter. The Tino put it in and went in off the Tonga. So I'm losing this will be my confirmed top tactical changes, but should maybe bring the Tonga off and just bring off Sanchez. I need a goal for a draw now. So Harry Winks isn't playing as well. I'll bring him off. Here's Aurea to Kane, and it's no good, and whoop. Oh no. Dings. <laughs> They're in complete disarray. This is all fell apart. So this will be a loss. I see subs now. So winks off. I'll bring Harry Kane off for Lorente and bring Wanyama on for Harry Wins. Oh, I can't do anymore. So, 
Uh, spring Lorraine Thailand. So Billy Lane says this all cool. To Dilly Ali, to Winks, to Kane, and Sapphire Mignoy. Yeah, Liverpool just started to dominate this. I want to actually look at my completed passes. I believe that will be like low. Compared to Liverpool, just give them too many shots, and it's just not happening. To Soku, to Trivia, to Dyer, to Sasoku, to Dali, to Laronte, to Laronte, no goal. I just get thrash them like every couple of games. I can't really explain why. Kind of, I just do. He's winks to Ericsson to winks and misses. So it was a bad loss. I was just talking about how my defence was the fifth best in the league. And this just fell apart. Just seems so easy cruising it 2 0 up. And Davies injured for three to six weeks. And my best team in as well, it's pretty stupid, oh, no. Here we go, I'm in the Carabao Cup quarter final. So this is definitely gonna be a, a full rotation squad. With how many injuries I've got and how everything is. How many games I've done? I'm gonna do about four or five. Yeah, so we're down the fourth then, but we're still only one point off the top, and Man City had a loss, I think. However, it is. So it's my time really to. Uh, to kind of get the win and go top of the table. I missed out on that now, even though I got two goals in the game. Just saving the game at the moment. <laughs> It's quite competitive there, so you just think you got it all worked out and then you then you just lose the game. And your morale's worse and everything like that then. And you should struggle after losing. I want to learn deal for Gazaniga. So 
Uh, I'll try and try and get it to. I'll try and get it to be how much I want. So complain can't match this. I'll just have it. I'll just have it like that. Offer to clubs. Play monthly fee. Thank you. I use monthly fee. Thank you. I wanna. I wanna be like to let them buy them. Kind of. If they want to. Let's try that again. Just want to be able to negotiate with Cardiff what they want. If they're interested in the player, then they should be like willing to negotiate. Okay, I'm just going for the arrest at the moment. And not in the League Cup, that's all in the Caravaggio Cup that much. And I have to watch my stream back and see how good it's going to be. I've lost the kilobytes now somehow. Okay, it's going better now. So let's have a look at how many games I'm playing. 
other than the quality of the resolution of my game that I'm streaming. Um, it's hard to understand why I don't maybe get more followers. I said I'm not worried about that. Luan set for a move to Tottenham. I've actually got him before. Luan. Pre match analysis once he. So playing like that. No office for Casaniga. Um. Off of the clubs. I just want to do a transfer offer. To Cardiff. And let's keep it for this season. And get someone else. For next season. And be happy like he's going to go to them. So transfer offer is worth 2.2, .2, so let's make it 2.2 .2 and just go for that. So I just want to do it again, off of the clubs. Don't want to seem to not need it, off the clubs. So, let's go to the squad. All this stuff. I think my stream is maybe deteriorating. I want to have a look at um, how the game is. So, here we go. I've got the goalkeeper. And I want to do transfer status and I've really got his. Yeah, it's so not the squad status change. Squad status back up. Yeah, this is the matter at the moment, I think. And I'll wait to see what's going on. I'm going to So I'm going on that. Okay. So I'll continue. Just not liking how my actual kilobytes per second is going. I'll try and rectify that. Okay. 
Okay, so let's go back to this. I'll have the office of Casanica and stuff. Ask Casanica to speak to clubs. That's okay, so I'll just tell that. And go back to him. Transfer off his clubs. So I'll try 1.1. And off its clubs. Continue. So basically, I want to transfer him, but just have him stay here for the rest of the season so I don't have to stuff around and stuff around <coughs> next season. After speaking with Kieran Trippi, I believe the player's happy with his playing time right now, so that's good someone's happy. Carl Walker Peters, Fernando Laronte, Toby Oldwild. Here you go, Tottenham, Swansea. So that's very good. Let's go to tactics. Quick pick. Pick rotator squad, full rotation. Here we go. So I'm going to the subs now. So Gazaniga is the sub goalie. Sanchez in Harry Winks. Shayon Harrison. So I don't want him there, I want Sosoku there. I want uh, Fernando Laurenti in. And Danny Rose can be in there. So that's about what I want. So let's see how we go now. We're at dollar eighty against Swansea. And let's see how we go. Sorry if the match is not good. I'll try and get this to work. Here we go, kick off. Let's see what happens. Okay, I'll keep the Swansea. Yeah, my, my kill bites are way down at the moment, so it won't be as good the actual match. I don't think. I apologise for that. This will have to be the last game until I work out. <laughs> to get the actual internet better. Okay, so it's Norton intercepted by Walker Peters to Sung Yu Min to Wanyama to Dali Ali to Edwards the under 21 for Spurs Trippers going on, crosses in Kane's there, Sung Yu Min's there, goal. Nice and easy, but this was kind of how it was with Liverpool, so 
So I'm not going to just write it down as win at the moment, but it's looking good. Yeah, so I can kind of see that the, the match replay isn't going that good. And that's why I've got a, a lesser quality like for when it goes like this. So Trippier's got it to Edwards. Ericsson's got it to Deli Ali. To Ericsson, to Trippier, goes forward try and gets over one, and goes to Dali Ali, goes to Ericsson, has a shot, and just misses. Okay, I'm having a look at what it's doing, it's still doing alright. At the moment so it's improved, and it has improved, so we've got improvement out of it. Yeah, thanks for watching Still Snorlax and then Jinty kind of um, I just want to see how many games I've done I've been streaming it for about nearly two hours so I like to just stream kind of for that long have actually had a loss kind of in this stream but like I've had that many wins in the last like ten games that it kind of doesn't matter, and like I'm not really worried about this game, but it's, and it's it's been like I'm actually playing pretty well, and I've got a full rotation squad, so so if I win, then I guess I deserve to. There's a goal. The form's not good enough. Tom Carroll got a goal. Do not worry about that. Too good by Tom Carroll, our former player, I think. Just got the way with Hitler, and Vaughn made a mistake to, to be a threat to me. Pretty sure that I've got the chat here to see, but said I don't know whether you're chatting or not. But said I think you're watching as well, right? And I'm pretty sure you can hear me. Here we go. Goal to Marcus Edwards. He's a real goal scorer here in Goal Sync. So this is maybe a free kick again. Getting the free kick goal. Just off the corner. Gets headed out to Trippier though, then Kane, and then Edwards. Just a lovely play. Another free kick to Ericsson to Wanyama. Plays it around to Deli Alli. Plays it to Kane. An easy goal here, penalty. That is a foul in. Okay, Kane to take the penalty. I think he hasn't missed that many this season. This will put us 3 1 up before half time. Oh, he saved it. He saved it. Amazing goalkeeping.
Here it's some of the corn hearts of the Tonga and no good. Kayla's run sorts her again. Let's start the second half. <coughs> so this is actually the quarterfinal of the League Cup, or Carabao Cup, if you didn't know. Okay, Norton with the ball goes to Mesa. Norton back with the ball. Mawson to Wilfried to Carroll to Wilfried. The sliding tackle by Manyama dispossesses him to Dyer to Vertonghen to Trippier to Edwards to Dali Ali. To someone there, but Sorty intercepted. But Tonga with it, Onyama with it, Trippier with it, <coughs> Edwards with it, goes through, Sun Yu Ming gets the goal. Lovely ball by Trippier, oh sorry, Edwards. Edwards did the, an assist now. He must be the highest rating, I'll have to have a look for that. It's under 21 for Spurs. Okay, Trippier the one Yama goes to Walker Peters, brings it forward, Sung Yu Min takes it around, plays it the one Yama to Dali Ali to Dyer, back to him, back to one Yama, Walker Peters on the wing, brings it inside to Ericsson. To Dali Ali, to Trippier, and across it in, and it sung him in for another goal. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Tottenham Hots were a red hot, sung him in, celebrates his hat trick. Okay, so I can sub him off now, I think. And just sub him off. That's maybe my first hat trick, I'm not too sure, in the game. So I can bring on Musa Sasaki. Uh, the song human and changing with Edwards and I bring Harry Winks on Christian Eriksen and Laurent Taylor on Harry Kane. See if Laurent taking in the goal. Okay, Mesa to Norton, I'm 4-1 up though, so there shouldn't be any comebacks this time, Abraham should have just done this to Liverpool really, Walker, Peters to Edwards, 
brings it forward to Deli Ali. To Trippia. Crosses to Winks. Goal. That's just too good, this. Too good, this performance. It's total football. With with my um full rotation squad as well. I just want to have a look at the end of the game and how many completed passes I had. Oh, that was a nice play. Here's the throw in to Woodburn, to Norton, to Vertongan. Then who intercepts Boschilia to Carol to Harry's goes forward, Dyer gets it. Goes back to Boschilla, to Lato, Trippier tackles, Deli gets it, Deli Ali, and then Sasako tries to take it down the wing and gets tackled, goes back to Boschilla, to Carol, intercepted by Dyer, to Winks, to Deli Ali, to Sasaku, to Trippier, across as an easy goal, Edwards. It was for another goal. Six one. Bomb kicks out. Sasaka is trying to get it and ends up with it. Takes it down the wing. Tries to cross it. It goes out for a corner, I think. So I've got another corner. Winks crosses it in. And it's headed out. By Swansea. And like, if this was a normal Carrier Bay Cup match and I had my full squad in, like some people might do, then I can understand it being 6-1. But I said I've got my subs in, most of my subs in like a full rotation kind of thing. And you try and play with full rotation squad, see how many games you play, win then. Trippier... Tackles and goes out for a throw in. Full time. What a game. I just want to see the actual goals. I can't see all the goals here. I just want to see the actual goal scorers. So I have to click another screen to see them. So it match sets, so it player analysis. Three goals to Sung Hyun Min, two goals to Marcus Edwards by under 21 sensation, and one goal to Harry Winks. Player of the match is Sung Hyun Min, who didn't play that much of the match. 
just say that I just want him to get his hat trick and that was good enough. And I feel like that I was just dominating. I've got it there on the right wing and central as well, so this was very good how it's been. I'll just go to the teams, or overview, or summary. So I want to get out of this, go to the analysis. Let's get the team talk because I think I dominated in this game and this is what I can do and dominated the, the completed passes. If I can go there. Analysis, match stats, match stats, completed passes, 406 to Swansea and 400 to Tottenham. So they both just had more passes complete. So it wasn't actually to have more passes complete than the opponent, it was just to have more overall for our team. And we were just clinical in front of goal, and we had 18 shots, 10 on target. The 60% of our shots on target were goals, but we had 10 shots on target. Just amazing, that. And really kind of earned the 6 one victory, I think, in, in this game. And look, you understand I'm taking off the players, but I just think that to take him off and I still won six ones so so that's kind of good and look Sung Yim Ming Lil Jade and can do all the rest so I'll just have a talk to him that's right so I'm him at rest Sung Hyun Min Just going to take him out for Kaja Stone I just want to see how many games I've played here So basically I've played all the regrets 1-1-3-1 one, one, Played South after 1-2-1 one, one, Huddersfield 1-3-1 one, one. I was ahead 2-0 against Liverpool and lost 2 4 and then 1 6 1 against Swansea in the Caravan Cup quarter final. So I'll play five games basically, and I think I can maybe wrap it up then. Let's go to my inbox. Yeah, so I think I think I'm in fourth. I'm very close to the first in the Premier League. It was just I lost to Liverpool and I was two 0 ahead of them and just all capitulated from then. So as you can see, there's 36 for Chelsea, 37 for Man City, 37 for West Ham, and 36 for Spurs, and 33 for Man United, 32 for Liverpool, 31 for Arsenal. So they're probably all the main ones, and 35 for Southampton. All the main ones are very close to being able to strike. 
for the top of the league, and um, I just think that I just need to hang in, to, in there as long as I can. And look, um, look, I only had a 1 0 loss against Arsenal and a 2 1 loss against Man City, but all my other ones have been two goals or more. It's just I haven't had that many of them. And of course, there's the, the leading amount of wins compared to anyone else. So that's the main thing, I think. If you can have either equal wins to the top team or to actually be like to, to have more than the top team and in, in how many wins you have over the same amount of games. We go one yard, we got 8.6. Ali got 8.4, Edwards got 9.5, Sun Yu Ming got 9.6, Trippy got 9.3. It was just a very good game. And everything like that. He's under 23s. I guess a nigga play. And Keenan Bennett's actually got the best player. I have to have a look at him. He's only valued at 39.5k, so I'm kind of not worried about him at the moment. And I think I've got most of the players. So basically, I just got into the under 23 squad and just picked all the players above kind of 100k or something. Like Ryan Moss dropped to 94k, but. I'm just not worried about that. It's around about 100k. And, like, I just want to look at what Marcus Edwards is. So he's 3.3 million now, Marcus Edwards. And he's, like, an amazing player. And he plays, like, a $33 million player sometimes. He's that good. How he plays for me. And it's just been really good. I just want to do my, my squad rotation now. I still quick pick and quick um, pick everyone. Just want Sun Human out versus Soku. And then for, for Cassia Sterling. Just looking for who it is. So that's very good then. I got that worked out kinda. I'm just working out myself the subs whenever I need to. So here's the final save, you see I'm saving the game. And then I'll get ready to have a rest from football manager and try and be like to to try to think how I'm going to win the Premier League in my first season in charge. And like if I don't, then I nearly will, I think. How do it is at the moment, depending on the injuries that happen. So let's see if has got something there. Unhappy with manager's treatment of Ben Davis, so I just want to talk to him. This has been a problem, big problem with with Ben Davies. So I'll just try to have a talk to him if I can. It's not like I can talk to him. <laughs> That's what I talked to you, Loris. Here we go. Yeah, I'm just on that. Let's 
Yes, that's what I want to do, so that's very good. Unhappy with manager straight when he lost. That's got rid of got rid of Ben Davies. He's it's unhappy of Manage this treatment of Hugo Lois. So I've done that kind of. So this is interesting, just sorting out team morale and everything like that. So I go to the dynamic and just look at who. So Harry Kane's a team leader. So I'll try and talk to Harry Kane then and see if he can help. Um, ambassadorial duties. Dressing room atmosphere. You want to see him? That's right, you can't really help Harry Kane. He said there's that many players with different attitudes that there's going to be some problems, so, so that's okay. Just want to have a look at Hugo Loris, off a new contract. So this is going to be a big loss, Hugo Loris, and to have a goalkeeper as good as him. And I think it, I want to see, here's Davies set to say at Tottenham. Well, it's this day, so it's very good. Sort of that out. That's a private chat. Okay, so that's... Oh, that's just what I said before. So another talk, and I was afraid it's gone down. So I can't see that, so the dynamic. Unhappy with and lost trust or lost all trust in his manager. So he wants to change the first team, that doesn't matter. And he wants to return the hold, so I'm going to lose. So it's only poor now, the managerial support. So this, uh, this thing with Hugo Loris is what happened because of Ben Davies, and he actually helped me solve it, but he's still unhappy, unfortunately. So let's just have one of these contracts. Let's have a look at their contract. It's until 2022. Let's not worry about him. That's very good then. So the long term contract with Hugo Morris. So this is what is what maybe will come in really handy. Okay, see you now. See you at Genti. Nine seventy. I'll try and follow you. So Ben Davis might actually leave and Hugo Morris isn't going to leave either. So I'll take this, keep this amazing squad together, at least till the end of the season anyway, and pass this um, um, transfer window, like the December, January transfer window, or 
end of December, and like basically the January transfer window. Okay, so let's save it again. You've seen they've got the the high profile team member or team captain kind of to sort things out with the player, leave it to leave the club. Kind of for me. And that's been really good, kind of, I think. And will Spurs actually win the Premier League and go 3 2 1 in the last three seasons? Okay. I'm just going off now. And let's see, see ya. Adios.